Hey, 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 Aries. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your Wednesday, September 16th to the 17th intuitive love tarot read. This is for my Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you guys today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there. Aries, if you would, before you leave, I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. Don't forget to comment as well. Let me know if this resonates with you, Aries. I'm going to get a channeled message here in just one moment. But first, let me grab a couple of cards here. What's going on for my Aries that they should know about? What's going on for my Aries? Let's see. Five of Swords, Aries. Seven of Wands. Hmm. They're saying don't beat around the bush, Aries. Get straight to the point. Now I'm hearing... Now I'm hearing them's fighting words, Aries. What are you getting yourself into, Aries? Hmm. Page of Cups here. Let's get one more. Queen of Wands. At the bottom of the deck, Two of Cups. Ooh, Aries, Aries, Aries. All right, let's get this message from Spirit. I'm curious. Okay, control your speech. It's like control your thoughts and speech while you're conversing with a specific somebody. And it has to do with those them's fighting words. And I don't, is this a, um, this two of cups? Okay. Okay. This may be like a fight over a person. Because it has to do with the two of cups. Or like, if you're with somebody, Aries, then it's their ex. Okay, any more information on this? They're saying look away. It's like, it's going to be difficult, Aries, but they're wanting you to sort of ignore what this other person is trying to do. They're trying to egg you on. They're trying to evoke anger out of you, I'm getting. So they're wanting you to say, no, 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 don't even, don't look in their direction. Just focus on your person, focus on that love. And they will, they will disappear. They will go away. Okay. All right. Let's see. Yeah, this person is angry and jealous. And I feel they're jealous because of this relationship. In the same token, I feel like somebody would will be apologizing to you. I don't think it's this person. I think it's somebody else. I'm not sure who it is, though. Yeah, you're very protective over this union if you're with somebody, or you will be. Because somebody is coming in. The Two of Cups here. All right, tell me about this Five of Swords um, person, please. Tell me about this Five of Swords person. It's like they want to, they'll lie. Wait a minute, something's flipped over here. What's flipped over? Where are you? There we are. Magician. Yeah. This is a trickster. They'll lie. They're going to say whatever they can to try to break you guys up. 
Be aware of that. I think you are. And I think you're just like, no. You're not believing any of their bullshit. Good for you, Aries. Good for you. Devil. The King of Wands. Yep. The Knight of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. I feel like you and this person, because we've got a power couple here, the King and Queen of Wands, I feel like that's you and this person. You see this person as toxic. This Five of Swords person, a magician. You work very well as a team with this other individual and nobody's going to be able to come in between you. It's like, nope, say what you want. I don't believe a word you're saying. So good for you, Aries. Clarifying the Queen of Wands, the Seven of Pentacles, the Four of Pentacles, the Four of Cups, and the Eight of Swords. Yeah, this this person, sneaky, sneaky. They're, they are going to lie to you about this other individual. That's why I say I feel it's, it's an ex of theirs. They're going to tell you lies. They are going to... I, oh, this is bad. I feel like they're going to purposely try to bait you. With like somebody coming on to you, bait you in that area so that they can then go to their ex and tell them that, you know, you're screwing around on them. But you don't take that opportunity. They're trying to get you all fucked up in your head. But you're confident in this relationship. You're confident in yourself, Aries. And you're not giving them what they want. You're just not. And it's pissing them off. Wow. Wow. Who is this apology coming from? I feel like this is like separate. Unless it's like for a different group. Tell me about the Page of Cups. Tell me about the Page of Cups. Why is this Page of Cups here and who is it from? Oh, okay. This person has a friend that basically, I, I think you come across this friend somewhere while you're out and about with your partner and they are like apologizing for their friend's behavior. They just think that they've got off the deep end and they're going to tell you that. Queen of Pentacles and Queen of Swords. So I feel like this friend is just like, ignore them. Ignore them. Focus on your relationship. I feel like they're, they're witnessing their friend sort of spiral. Wow. And they're almost, I'm getting like a very embarrassed, you know, feeling from this friend. Because I feel like this person is not only doing this to you, they're doing strange things outside of this to, to others. There may be a mental instability here with this person. Tell you the truth. Wow. Okay. So what is your advice? I don't think, I think you're going to be handling this very well. You just can't let them get to you. Yeah. Move on to peace. If you need to literally move, move. Because I, I don't think this person is stable mentally. Yeah. Three of wands. Your ships are coming in. Listen to your intuition on this. Make a judgment call, and I'm serious about this moving. If you feel like you need to move because of the instability of this person, I would say move. One more card. King of Cups. Don't close off your heart because of this individual. 
keep working on your um, romantic relationship with this person coming in. Could be a fire sign, in case you're wondering if you're not with this person yet. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, so they definitely have it in their chart. But this is somebody who's confident, who goes after what they want, okay? And you two are going to be very powerful together. And I don't think anything's going to be able to break this up. All right, Aries, I hope this resonates. Please drop a like below. Share and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading with me, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. Don't forget to comment as well. Let me know if this resonates with you. Have yourself a fabulous day, Aries, and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies tomorrow. Namaste.